I started to read the Holy Quran. At that time when I started to read the Holy Quran, I did not consider myself a Muslim. But by reading the Holy Quran, and I continued to read it, um, over the time I realized that I actually believe in that book. So at that time I realized, okay, if I believe in that book, then I must be a Muslim. In the start of 2005, I moved to Munich for studies and there I met the first time other Muslims in the tube because I was reading Quran in the tube. Okay, okay. so some Arab, Arab origin guy, he asked me and why I'm reading Quran, am I a Muslim? So I told him, I'm, I'm not a Muslim, but I think this is the book of God. So he's, he then said, then, then you're a Muslim. So I said, okay, then I'm a Muslim. First time I met Muslims and I started to debate with them several questions. I asked them directly, what do you think about Buddha? What do you think about Krishna and so on? Um, what kind of people are these? And so they were not sure in their answer. And um, eventually I, I prayed to God and asked him, is, is my understanding of the Holy Quran wrong? Or is there some truth I do not yet know? And after this uh, prayer, I found the homepage of the Ahmadi Muslim Jamaat. Uh, first thing what I, uh, on that journey, what I realized about the Holy Quran, okay, it must be from that very one God. And um, then after realizing, okay, it is, it is a book of God, I started to scrutinize the commandments. I tried to find the commandments in the Holy Quran and I was trying to um, adopt them in my own life. At that time I had no Muslim lifestyle at all, normal Western lifestyle. So slowly, slowly I tried to convert my lifestyle according the commandments of God I found in the Holy Quran. At that time I wasn't an Ahmadi Muslim, so I had no, no deep knowledge. But there are some clear matters like no alcohol, for example. Um, so these things, step by step, I implemented. And always when I implemented one more step, so always when I um, become, became more obedient to God Almighty, um, I realized that my whole life took a turn for the better. So that somehow motivated me always to, to do the next step. At that time, when, when I met the other Muslims, I, I wanted to live my life according to Islam, according to Quran. And now I met people who claimed to follow this very book, but they did it in a other way than, than I understood it. So this really, was a very difficult time for me. But as Allah says, you should have sabr, you should have patience, and you should pray to me to overcome any difficulty. So I did that, and that opened me, by the, only by the grace of Allah, that opened me the way in the Ahmadiyya Muslim Jamaat. And um, so I have to say, since uh, I'm an Ahmadi Muslim, I didn't have this kind of challenges, but there, of course, life is with challenges. But now I already had the first-hand experience that with sabr and salat you can overcome any difficulty.